Oh, because we haven't too many for this time. It's the Alien movies now. I don't have Alien, I mean, Alien vs. any of the Alien vs. Predator movies. I haven't seen any of the Alien vs. Predator movies. Um, or any of the Predator movies in general. I think we're watching, like, I think Alien, I mean, so Predator 1. But I haven't seen it. It's been a while since I've seen it. That's, we got six uh, Alien movies. Uh, Romulus is on here. Because I'm becoming a late this year. So, guy, uh, best, great, good, okay, meh, and bad. So, guy. Alien, Aliens, Alien 3, uh, Leo's Resurrection, Prometheus, and Covey. Alien. I mean, I don't think anyone's, I don't think anyone's gonna argue with this. Alien and Aliens are, uh, god, is it fucking amazing? Uh, so here's what I will say. If you guys are like, hey, well, should, I, should I watch Alien or Aliens? Here's what I think. If you want a suspenseful and scary fucking movie, um, I have a, an alien is you go to if you want, uh, but say if you want to like, so you still want tension, you still want a tense, a, a, a tense ass movie, but you want more characters and you want more alien, you want more aliens and you want a big fucking, you want, you want a, a much bigger threat. Aliens is the way to go. Personally, I kind of like aliens a bit better because there's a more characters, get a lot more characters, um, get some of it actually but it's still very fucking tense honestly uh it's so very tense um well the book that was the best ones uh -huh. and I, no one is gonna argue with that honestly uh no no one's gonna argue with that alien 3 so i so i seen uh someone was just not seen this on a third party site and yeah i did uh, and on a third point I saw, they, I saw these special editions of these movies, so I saw Alien, the student versions of Alien, Alien 3, it's the assembly cut, and it's the actual cut, and it's the, the actual gold cut, so I saw the assembly cut of Alien 3, and that, the only part I would want to put on bad, I'm gonna put on okay, here goes my reasoning, it's, it's not bad, it's honestly, it's, it's just boring, honestly. It's just really boring. Like, the prison scene, like... They got, like, global shots, uh, when, uh, it was, you know, when, 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 when um... They are arriving at Fury, at Fury 161, and there's, like, a whole, like, uh, the eclipse. That's a really cool shot. Or you get, you get the two moons. Those are really cool shots, in my opinion. Um, but the problem with Alien 3, it was, it's just very boring. Like, the characters, they all look the exact same, uh... I'm not, I'm not gonna be dead fucking serious about this. Only, I, I only remember three characters from Alien 3. Ripley, of course, Clemens, played by, uh, Charles Dance, and, uh, Dylan. So, so I'm not being dead fucking serious, so those are the only three characters I remember from the movie. It's not, it's, it's not bad. Oh, you know, comparison to Alien and Aliens, oh, yeah, it's, it's pretty bad, but... It's just boring. Uh, you know, you get the prison, get a prison, uh, which you don't know which spot prison where at where where the prison you're at because it's very like essentially it's like very desaturated with the color. There's not much color there, um, so it's very desaturated with the color. The characters they all look the same. They all like none of them stand out. None of them stand out whatsoever, honestly. Um, so it's not, it's not bad. It's just, it's okay. It just, it's boring. On and like, it's just boring. On like, uh, resurrection. People call it, people are probably gonna want me to put this in bad as well. It's as long, as long as the alien three. It's just okay. Uh, basically, um, the they they try to they clone Ripley. Uh, Ripley eight, that's what she's called. These plays way, way in the future. Uh. And a clone, a clone Ripley, and yet I will say it's 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 a resurrection is a bit better than Alien Three, but not because so Alien Three they kind of like to try to take the form uh like the uh I like the story like kind of like how Alien it was where it was of one alien and the resurrection it was multiple, and then resurrection is okay and along with the three it's okay, it's not bad um. Like, I think the movie does definitely does fall far, like, towards the end. You can, like, goofy ass, you get some really goofy scenes. Characters lose, like, characters lose memory. I can, like, tell the difference between the characters. Um, 
it, the third, the last part, like last like say twenty minutes, and it's really fucking stupid because you get like a, you get like a uh, a clone basically as like a white uh, xenomorph. You get like a white uh white xenomorph that makes like um mixes the uh queen's DNA and Ripley's DNA because Ripley she is or was a mix she was a maid with her DNA and an alien's DNA so. We gotta get like a, a white version, as you can see, it's like they give it a, they give it a face for some reason, uh, they give it like eyes for some reason, which is really stupid. Uh, I can't say it's bad, it's it's honestly, if I had to watch either 3 or Resurrection, I'd probably go for Resurrection, because characters, I can at least, I can at least tell the characters apart much better. Uh, I guess but you get a look cool, like a uh, really talented, really talented uh, people in it as well, so um. I think the resurrection is also okay, honestly, and then we get Prometheus. I think actually Prometheus was actually really good, actually. I thought Prometheus was really good. It was supposed to be great. Basically, it was like, it was like pretty cool to be alien, and it shows like, um... It's like how the aliens came to be, basically. Um, it's actually really, I actually, I actually kind of enjoyed it, actually. Um, David, I thought David was going to be like, David, uh, Michael Fassbender, he did a really good job as a, be like the a robot, but of course, nowhere near as good as Bishop plays play play by Lance and Erickson. They honestly cannot pick anyone better to play Bishop and Lance and Erickson, honestly. Um, Michael Fassbender, Michael Fassbender, he did really good as uh, David. Um, he did really good. Uh, characters, I really don't care if the character is really, pretty really, really likable. Um, they kind of shows like how they came to be. Like, uh, basically, the engineers, basically, like, the, these guys, basically, to see it in here, the, these guys, they were mixed with, like, a giant fucking face hugger. Uh, it's like, it's like, they go to, uh, it's not like LV426, it's a different, at least it's a LV223 they go to instead. Um, based upon, like, a pods, which is, like, some, like, weird goop shit in it, and, uh, so it's very much different, but it's still in the alien realm. So like it, and then the, uh, it shows like it's people and how they came to be. It's pretty cool. So and at, at the end, it's like a the face hugger, the giant face hugger mixed with the uh, uh, engineer, and it shows like how. And then at the end, it's like a low xenomorph, but it's much different. It has no one here. I thought it was actually pretty cool. Actually, how they did it, actually. Um, covenant, <sighs> covenant. I, I'm so sorry, fan. Like this movie, I'm so sorry. If anyone likes this movie, I am so sorry. Covenant's bad. I'm so fucking sorry. I, um, yeah, so here's what they should have done with Covenant instead. They, with Covenant, what they did, they tried to make David, who was the antagonist of Prometheus, they turned him into the villain. For some fucking reason, they turned him into a villain. And in Prometheus, he was that he was the antagonist. Uh, basically, this show trying to find, uh, he's so, like, he, yeah, he was the only robot, so he, uh, he didn't try, he tried, well, the one dude was kind of like an act, like, act like an asshole to him, so he kind of gave, like, a little, uh, he didn't help us in the characters, he didn't help them out, and he tried to learn them more about, like, the engineers, how, who they were, how they got there, so he tried to learn them more, Covenant, they tried to make him, like, the, um, uh, the, the creator of the aliens for some fucking reason. Well, they should not. Here's what they should have done, in my opinion, for Covenant. This is what they should have done. David, he uh, selected white, the other uh, white uh, the xenomorph thing called an enomorph, in uh, enomorph, I believe. Like the white ones, like the point of pointy, uh, pointy head. I thought that was going to be like a Lean, lean up to how the queen of what's made. I was actually, I was sure it would have been pretty cool. Here's what I would, here's what I think they should have done. The white one gets transformed later on into the queen. It gets much bigger. Because it's like a white one, gets, it's it's the one that stands out. It should have been a queen instead. Should have turned into a queen, and then David tries to control the queen. But the queen has a mind of her own. It says, fuck you to David. If she kills David, well, actually... Now, it's, they take off the shit, they go to uh, LV-426, uh, but while they're there, David tries to uh, control control the queen, but the queen won't be having any of it, so the queen kills him, the queen kills him, and then they crash land into LV-246. That's what they should have done. 
that would make much more fucking sense. Because the way it shows like how the how the ship got got to LB uh, LB two forty six, it would show like the queen was still the creator of the aliens, but they would try to they would they would try to, like create they could like mix like the white one with the uh, some like DNA thing and like made the queen himself, but the queen like kills him uh, while they're like on the way to the planet, and the, the ship crash lands to L to LB two four six. And then it would be it would be a lot more sense if they would have went that route, but for some fuck reason they tried to make David the creator of the aliens for some fuck reason. I don't get why. So they tried to make David the creator of the aliens, which I'm assuming no fuck sense on. So uh it was bad. Like there's like a chase scene at the end. Like the, the characters they do stupid shit. Characters they really do stupid shit. Like uh, but there's like one scene where the face hugger it kind of like comes out the back and instead usually comes out the chest. It comes out the back of the eyes. I thought I was oh I thought I was, I thought I was actually really cool. That could have been the queen. That could have been it should have been the queen. It's like because she's she's unique. She comes out the back instead of the chest. I think that would have been pretty cool. And then there's fucking doing that scene. There's a scene where the characters suck on a fucking blow. Like it's a comedy. So I'm like are oh, you. I was watching it and we were like, oh, you fucking kidding me there. But I was like, huh, maybe, maybe they'll, uh, maybe they'll bounce back, but no. Is that being David, the villain, for some fucking reason? Having him the creator of the, of the aliens. I really hope the Ro... 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 I think that's how you say it. Here we go, so alien Romulus. Here we go. Um... Billy... Billy Sky. Hmm. I don't. I don't think he's really sky. I do think he's a piece, but he's 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 a piece. I'll just mean, uh, first alien, obviously. Um, this full on cast. At wait, act. What's it? Why does this is an actor? Actor. It's weird. Huh. I'm kind of curious on how to, I might, might watch this in the theater when it comes out. It comes out, uh, off the 16th, I mean, like, an hour, almost two hours, damn. It, there's no way it, can, it can't be as bad. It cannot be as bad as it was cut top it. It cannot be as bad as top of no fucking way. There was no fucking way that it can be as bad as top it. I might watch this in the theater, I might. Um, so it seems like they're going to the idea of the cast, how small it is. It seems like they're going to the idea of it's going to be, like, it's going to be, like, a... Alien, how it was like a very small cast. That's what this, this feels like. That's what this really feels like. Now, I might, might go, might go, might watch the last one if I'm going to use. I might go watch that, but yeah, um, it's pretty much the tier list. Uh, Alien and Aliens, the best. No one's gonna argue with that. No one else is gonna argue with that. Prometheus, I think Prometheus, Prometheus was a really good movie. I enjoyed it. We invest actually the okay and covenants back. I'm so sorry. Um I don't know what you guys think. Uh it's just my opinion, so I don't think anyone's gonna argue with this. The alien alien and aliens being the best. I don't think any, anyone's gonna argue with this. I was like maybe like some of these other ones, but definitely not with alien aliens. Definitely not. Uh 